Now, motorists plying the Lagos Ibadan Expressway have been cautioned to comply with traffic regulations while rehabilitation work is ongoing along the axis. The Federal Road Authority issued the warning against the backdrop of recurring accidents and other road emergencies that continue to cause complete shutdown of that corridor. TVC News correspondent Ifanaya Eze reports. This section of the Lagos Ibado Expressway has been a major cause of sporadic gridlock along this corridor. The Federal Ministry of Works has finished rehabilitation work on this section of the road and has opened it up to traffic, but is insisting that motorists must respect traffic guidelines to forestall accident situations such as what is seen right behind me. This happened barely 10 minutes after officials of the Federal Ministry of Works did a formal opening of the completed section to traffic and echoed warnings of traffic compliance to motorists. The road has been constructed, this particular section has been reconstructed and now open to traffic. So we expect that, and that is the way it will go from section to section. So we want to urge our people, we are appealing to the people, so please exercise patience, this is the busiest section on this road. Already, traffic has stretched for miles again impeding smooth vehicular movement. The federal works officials had complained that motorist indiscipline and breakdown of vehicles on the access have repeatedly caused circumstances such as this. This is construction zone area. Construction zone area, nobody can drive at 120 kilometers an hour within this period. People should drive, of course, if everybody is driving 50 kilometers an hour, it won't have any problem. And then, of course, you have a lot of vehicles that are not even roadworthy. They keep breaking down at every point. And these are the problems. The Federal Road Safety Corps has said that defaulting motorists will be penalized henceforth. We've started a new strategy whereby if you drive against traffic, we apprehend you, we charge you for dangerous driving. And dangerous driving offense is 50,000 alone. There are some people who give them up to 80,000 euro. And for those that have not been able to pay, six months, we're just waiting for six months. After six months, we we'll approach the High Court. And we forfeit it to the federal government. We pay the money to the, to, the, to the federal government coffers. According to the Federal Ministry of Works, the Lagos Ibadan Expressway, which is a key infrastructure project to the federal government, is about 40% completed. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News.